video, I've got a tutorial using the Lime Crime Venus palette. So I was watching Tiffany's haul video and it so inspired me to pull this bad boy out of my uh, collection and use it. You know, there's a lot of controversy behind this brand and to each his own. You can have your own opinions, your own thoughts, but this is a palette that I have owned prior to all of the unfortunate events. And you know what? I'm gonna use it. I can't just, I feel guilty enough I haven't used it enough. So I decided to pull it out and create this look. And you know what? I definitely think that this is a nice pretty and pink look that you can wear for a Valentine's Day if you're up for it. So why not, right? So for this tutorial, I'm, more, I'm mostly focused on the eyes and I skipped all the face routine stuff. Um, but everything that I have used, I'm gonna list down below if you're interested in knowing. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get started and thank you guys so much for watching. So I've already put my lids, filled in my eyebrows, and of course you know we're using the Venus palette from Lime Crime. And the first color I'm gonna go into is Divine as my transitional crease shade. I'm just taking a fluffy brush, this one in particular is my Wing Goss number three, and just buff that into the crease area as our transition. Doesn't have to be perfect whatsoever, but it's just gonna help the other colors have something to blend into. Now with a flat shader brush, I'm gonna go into the shade Shell and then a little Fix Plus to intensify this color. And we're gonna apply that to the lid. And I'm using a padding motion instead of a sweeping motion to really get the most impact. Well, not impact, but pigment. I know you know what I meant. <laughs> Now with my MAC 217, I'm gonna go into this Deep Burgundy Muse, and we're going to use that directly into the crease to blend the two shades together. Now I'm gonna go back in with a fluffy brush, back into Divine, and kinda of just clean up my crease area, add to it a little. Just so that the, uh, the burgundy and pink don't overpower my eyes. I'm now gonna go into the shade Aurora, this light shade here, and just highlight my brow I'm gonna quickly finish up my face makeup and then come back and we'll finish the eyes. So I went ahead and did all my face makeup. I did a little wing liner. I used in my waterline this MAC pencil in pure white. Just because, I don't know, I feel like I want my eyes to be a little... You could just use whatever liner you like though. But let's go ahead and finish the lower lash line. Put a little color down there. So, oh yeah. I have been using the Sephora Color Switch. There we go. The Sephora Color Switch by Veramona. Yo. In between, like using these bright, dark, crazy colors, I'll just go in and clean off the brush, and legit, it's clean. So I highly recommend this. I know you can definitely dupe this with other sponges, but I've been using this and I've been loving it. 
and I recommend it, so I want to share it with you. So, just going to take. I'm gonna take the color Muse and start off with that on my lower lash line. And I'm gonna actually keep that on the outer portion and get lighter as I go in. So I can switch in between colors. <laughs> I'm gonna take Shell, which is the color on my lids, and apply that to the front portion. And now a pencil brush, I'm going to take the color Divine, this one, and just blend everything together. Oh, I feel like we need an inner turtle highlight. So... I'm gonna take Aurora, the same shade that I used for my brow bone highlight, and use it as my inner tear duct highlight. There we go. Now let's take care of these lips. So I've got NARS Audacious Anita. I'm gonna use that. And then because I can't help myself, <laughs> I need some gloss, something on top of this. I'm gonna use this Manica Dar lip gloss in Lucky. Pretty. So here's the finished look. I hope you guys have enjoyed. All the products that I've used will be listed down in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay beautiful and I'll see you soon. Bye.